Okay, there we have it. We have Marco, Ratchet, and Nevo playing for Team Science. So that is actually a sick lineup. And then the Slotty, Megarian, and oh my... Bro, what is that match? Oh my god, man. Okay, so welcome, welcome everyone into the second semi-final. We have Sign versus Team Reden, or, or the N, as I'm gonna call them. So, um, we have a stacked match coming up, but I'm gonna quickly explain you the format. So, we have team mode that will be played. So, the team, after each round with the most accumulated points, will win the round. First place is worth six points, then five for second, and so on and so forth. So, the better your position, the more points you get. Maybe the plugin is still on seven, but it doesn't even matter too much. Um, because it is, is still the same then, because the positions don't really matter. But you have to collect seven points in order to close out a map, but the points matter. So all the points that you accumulated on all of those three sub-matches are really important. Right now it is Megarian versus Nevo, and it is Megarian overtaking him here. As you can see, it's 876, but it doesn't matter, because first, fourth and fifth is more than second, third and sixth, and Reden getting themselves the first point, 1-0. And as I said, all, or like every point matter in this format. First point for RDN. A close round though, to start off with Tom with a mistake. He is dead. Marco also not with the best start. Ratchet also with a mistake. Then we have Nevo. There. Where can I change cameras? Here? I'm on five, six, four, one, and two. Okay, I think this should be good. I don't have to swap all the time. Megorian Slotty ahead of Nevo. But it will not be enough for Team Sign. So they will take it first, second, third even. Ratchet, Marco, and also Nevo have made mistakes. Nevo, of course, had to risk it. But still, he is in last with that. Next point for RDN, for Team Ariden, 2-0. Then it's... Mm -hmm. I do have two buttons for Nevo, this all makes no sense, like the spectating. Like 10 buttons for the sign players, but no button for the read players. Whatever, I'm just gonna go like that. Just with a tab. Because I can quickly click on the respective player. So Megarian leading, Slotty on second, and then we have Marco who's in the mix. But again, this is looking really good for Team Reed in here. As you can see, Megarian will take it. Slotty on second, and Tom on third indeed. A point 80, a point 83, and a point 85. Great round indeed. And the next point for Team Reden. 3 0. It's a little bit too loud. It's like super quiet actually, Storm. Can put it even more quiet. But um, actually, I don't know. Is it too, too loud? Maybe it's better like that. Hopefully. I'm just gonna leave it like that then. All good. Okay, now it's perfect. Okay, okay. I think only one volume to, or like, I only changed one volume, but now Ratchet with a Nevo, they need to get first and third, or even, yeah, like, first would be good, but Megorian and Tom have a good amount of speed, but actually Nevo overtakes Megorian there. He was a bit ahead. But since Megorian had the fastest match PB, how was the tie declared here again? Was it fastest match time? Was it login? Was it being first on the server? It is um, Megorian leading, but it doesn't matter. It's the first point for Team Sign. So Nevo Ratchet first, uh, second and third, and then Marco on P number five. And this is enough to take home a round victory. So one, two, three, you need to get seven points to force the next map. Really important to get that, of course. Go directly through the winner place against Team TC. 
and the loser plays against Team Luckers for the first one or for the third place. So every sub-discipline is worth a respective amount of points. And right now, Sign is um, having a good shot here to take home this round as well. Second, third and fourth for them. Nivo will take second, Ratchet on third, Marco on fourth. But yeah, a great round. Every player in between 0.2 of uh, each other. So great to see that. But yeah, very, very nice consistency from the players. So 3-2, to two, but very close match indeed. Let's go with uh, Tom for the next round. As he uh, didn't get the worst start. I mean, there was um, Ratchet who has made a mistake here. But also Tom, um, yeah, maybe a little bit of a misalignment. And uh, Tom still finds himself in the back of the pack of the players who have not made a mistake. Marco and Nebo have to go for the attack to stay alive in this round. And Nebo is on first. Marco can get that third place. But no, Nebo is also not going to stay ahead here of Megarian. Again, at two hundredths of a second. Ratchet, of course, has made that mistake. And with that, he finds himself on last place. Yeah, of course, we can check out Daddy's here. So Megarian, Daddy 1, Nebo, Daddy 2, tied. Then Slotty with Daddy 3, only 100 behind. And then, so literally the top 6 are the players that are playing right now. Bruh. Or like, okay, yeah, it is uh, one player missing here. Magorian and Slotty have one. Uh, but so doesn't have Tom, but maybe he has not practiced in um, this respective format. Because you have different Daddies in this um, situation. Macaroni, no, that's not. Thomas on Daddy 10, and never mind. But still a great time of 0.6. He sometimes also the consistency really matters. So Nevo leading Ratchet. Yeah, super far behind actually, but they're still gonna stay ahead here. Marco with a mistake, and no, this will be the throw away in this round. Marco could have gone for the safe finish, but Tom is getting that fifth place, and with that. Marco not finishing and 2 to 5. This was actually an important round. 2 5 versus 4 to 3. So RDN with the next map or with the next point to their name. No one has made a mistake here in this very tight passage where you have to go through the triangle of the checkpoint. But Marco not with the best amount of speed as you can see also here. Slotty going so far up so he gets himself some airtime in this part. But still gets a very good approach for that. Uh, or in exchange to that, let's say like that. Marco, however, is holding strong and goes up into fourth place. Tom with a great line, but he has to steal a little bit more by the looks of the great wiggle though, but Marco with more speed and Marco will stay ahead. But again, a great round here. 0. 0.62 winning time, 66 for a second. And then the 75, 85, 87 and 0. 0.90. Man, every time below 44. And that was the next point for team sign. So a spark of life from them. So great rounds. Also, a great overtake there. You could have seen Tom went for the wiggle, but it wasn't quite enough because he was just steering in a little bit more. So, um, that is what really was the game changer in this ending. Sometimes it can be really hard to understand that, but there is the rule that you don't want to like steer too much on grass and you want to wiggle if you have like a, yeah, a respective amount of speed. So, wiggling with 150 doesn't work, but with 200, 220, it works or something like that and then 300 it's already too much to wiggle you just want a smooth steer there you can see it here Marco with the overtake actually it's another tie but actually this time it really matters Marco on a second Megorian on first and with that this was the decider and team Reden has taken it home my god a tie has decided it's here but that's the spirit of the game of course This is the spirit, guys. So 
Gorion in the lead and they can close it out here. Team Reden can go home with the map victory and a four point advantage compared to Team Assign. Right now it's not looking too promising because Ratchet, Marco and Nevo, so all of the three sign players are like in the mix. And also Nevo can go for the overtake, it's another tie. Uh, but this time it doesn't matter, second, third and fifth is enough. But man, so many ties in this sub-match already. It is uh, incredible, 4-6, to six, round number 11 coming into play. And a close round yet again. Into the next round we go. We have Magarin with a great start, but look at the speed from Ratchet, from the German player, together with Nemo. Nemo, not Nemo. He is attacking, or they are attacking Magarin. Also, Marco with a great, great approach and a great transition into this part, coming closer to Magarin, who still holds strong into that lead, or to in the lead here. Slotty and Tom are a bit behind, so they need to get at least one or two positions out of that but Nevo falling behind but good amount of speed will Nevo get that he will stay on p5 and we have Ratchet and Marco on second and third and they still holding strong five to six that was very important for team sign and now we have the situation where we could go into the infamous round number 13 uh, but still getting those points is already very important yes Maxi it's the first map So very important round for both teams. 7 to 6 would not be like a huge loss for them. But of course you want to take that map win for the tiebreak advantage. We have Nevo in the lead, Ratchet on P number 4. Where is Marco? Marco has made a mistake so that means that Ratchet needs a third place in order to get themselves on the scoreboard. Looking good, Ratchet with a bit more speed but no he was risking it and with that they're not getting it, but now actually one of the members here from team... Oh my god, wait a second. Oh, wait, what? What happened there? Why did someone... Why did Megorian DNF? Oh no, man. There was a thrown away point, and Nevo was actually getting first in this round. So now 6-6. Six to six. Last round will decide it. There's no tennis mode. Let's go ahead. Who will take it? Will Team Sign make it? Nevo with a mistake here. And that's of course a very, very important gem for Team Sign. So this is looking good for them to make it. Slotty is leading. Great amount of speed. Ratchet also with a great approach though. But it's looking like that it will be Team Reden taking it. They are on P2, 3 and 4. Ratchet also now with the best accumulated speed in this sector. So Tom goes into the lead. And Ratchet with a very inside approach. Now they need to get a good ending. It's still very close. A lot of things can still happen, especially in this ending. But Reden will take it here. Second, fourth, and fifth. No, wait, what? 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 Wait. Bro. Huh? How did they lose that? Uh, okay. What happens? I don't understand. Did Megorian fail the ending? <laughs> Yo, Jens. <laughs> Dumm. <laughs> Was geht, Jens? Danke für den Reset. Und hallo, Küken. Hallo, hallo. Das war richtig dumm, Leute. Richtig dumm. I'm, I'm so confused. I have to see that one again in slow-mo or something. I have to see that one again. He said he bugged. Yeah, this ending, of course, can be very buggy. It can also really bug yourself. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I'll just stop. <sighs> so, actually, Team Reden has lost this one. So, um, sign leading is 7-6. So, great and close match. 
after sign looked um, not that good actually i mean they were struggling a bit making more mistakes in total they've just won the rounds that were really decisive and now we're gonna go to the next map from kisla actually my favorite map from all of those three maps after seeing all of those maps on the top tier we have um, blind eyes from kisla so again two warm-ups before we're gonna start and i'm gonna take a sip of what ah Wegen the stream. Yeah, the stream. Welcome to the stream, everyone. I hope you're all doing good, guys. Hopefully, you're all having a great day. We went to the grand final in the first semi. It was Team TC. With only winning one map. Team TC has only won one map. And they have made it. <clears throat> so Luckers is in the match for third place. Milmi Red. Is Milmi playing? Pork. Milmi Slotty Megorian. Marco Nevo Sky. That's a sick lineup from both teams, actually. Not sure how good Milmi. I haven't really seen too much from him on tag. But he's, of course, a very fast player. Not gonna lie. So, good luck. Shout out to Kanjika. Hello, hello. Hope also you are having a fantastic Sunday, man. Alright, maybe one more warm up. So I'm gonna use that to grab myself some water because I don't have any water nearby. I'll be right back. Fifty coppers. Yeah. What did I actually do with my coppers? I don't know. I think someone actually wanted coppers and I just sent them to him because I don't play this game anymore and I don't need them. Okay, so we are starting now with the second sub match. Surprisingly, Sign has won the first one. It was RDN or Reden looking very strong. But now the scoreline is 7 to 6 in favor for Team Sign, and we're gonna play or we're gonna see a Blind Eyes as map. Two out of three. So how this works, guys, the points from each sub-match matter. So 7-6 is, of course, a very good um, foundation. Is that a word that I can use there? I like a very, very good... I think foundation works. Um, for the team, better to lose 7-6 than 7-1 or something like that. But of course, they could have been in the lead. But now there's a one-point advantage for team assigned. But let's go into the first round. Slotty and Megorian. With a great start, but Slotty with a little bit of a mistake. So he drops down to P number three. Nevo goes for the attack, but got himself a little bit of a slide there. So he lost a lot of time. Where are the other players? Marco and Sky. Marco with a terrible amount of speed. And Sky goes up into that third place. Will Nevo get that first position? No, it's not enough. But again, a close round of 48 for Megorian, which is a very good time. Slotty with a point 65 and Milmi with a point 69. So um, 
A close round, but the first point goes to Team Reden. Team Reden with the first point, and with that, that means that the score is tied up again, 7-7 seven to seven in the total standing. But let's go ahead and to the next one. Nivo and Marco with god tier starts. They are so far ahead and we see two Reden players already with a mistake and also Sky with a small mistake in this transition, clipping it a bit. But of course penalties are not a thing in Trackmania Nations, but of course it bugs, so you can bug in every corner. And when you go over Randstein or maybe even in the mid rows, but mid rows were more in Trackmania 2. But Marco and Nivo are taking it out of Slotty. Actually, Marco gets overtaken by Slotty there, but it doesn't matter. But a point 31 from Nivo, that is a great time. Only point 25 away from world record. And with that, the next point for Team Sign. And the first point on this particular map. Blind Ice from Kisla. Okay, so I only have sign players on my hotkeys again. And Sky right now, however, is um, on fifth place after mistake from him and also from Milmi, we could have seen that driving and it's looking good for Team uh, Sign at the moment. They just need a first place though, just quote unquote. But Magorian coming dangerously close to Nevo here in this ending, but it's not enough. Another 3x from the German player, a very, very great tech player indeed. And Nevo takes it, Sky and Marco on fourth and fifth. And this is sealing the deal again. Second point for Team Sign, looking good. Let's follow Milmi here, who's a bit struggling on um, this particular, or in the previous rounds, he was struggling a lot. Let's go ahead and follow the Czech driver. Of course, has also a long background in Trickmania. Used to be one of, yeah, a very good United player. But, um, of course, then he was swapping to Stadium. And has also gotten an insane pace there. Not particularly a tech player, but you can see he can keep up with the pace. But right now, he didn't get the best start. So he finds himself a little bit further behind. And Slotty and Megorian are in dire need of that. But however, it's one of their members who have made a mistake from Team Science. Sky is too far behind. And this will be the point for Team Ariden. First, fourth and fifth is enough. So if you add the points... We have um, 9 plus 8 is 17, 7, 6 and 3 is 16. So that means that the point goes to Team Reden. So round number five, two to two, equal match thus far. And also an equal round here, only Marco who has made a mistake. So Nivo and Sky need first and third or first and second preferably. But Sky not with the best amount of speed. So let's hold the creation player is going for the attack, has more speed than Magorian and Slotty, but only a little. But it will not be enough and he makes that mistake. So Mim is able to pass him. Nivo will even get overtaken by Slotty in the ending. And the next point for Team Reden after another mistake from a sign player. So three to two. And we're coming closer and closer to seven to the point of seven. So yeah. Let's go ahead. Two three. Can sign and do something now. Let's follow Marco in at the beginning of the map. Also seen uh, Marco um, a lot of times in, uh, in Trackmania 2020, who he was um, partaking in the Cup of the Day. And also played very well there. I think he even won one edition, if I recall it correctly. Very skilled player as well. In this round, however, he finds himself on the fourth place. Also, maybe with a great start, Nebo 
on um, that battle for first place. What a great line for both Marco and Nevo going up into the lead here. Can they stay ahead or not? Great, great ending, but Marco losing, losing a little bit in the ending. And the last positions will decide it, and Slotty will get himself that fifth place. And Marco has lost it in the ending, but great round there from both teams. But it wasn't quite enough for Team Sign to make something happen. So 4-2 to two for Reden. Can Sign win this round? Nevo had to release just a little bit by the looks of it. Not sure if he was fully risking through that, but I would have actually panicked release there. Milmi, the only Reden player left alive. Sky, Marco and Nevo both or all three players have survived this round and we see Magorian and Slotty too far behind to have a saying so they can just save it here it doesn't matter if Milmi gets first they just have to survive here and second third and fourth would be enough for team sign to claim another point and they will actually get first third and fourth so um, Sky was overtaking Milmi in this ending but again a good round from Milmi after struggling a bit he now is back on track and gets decent times here. So 4-3. to three. Important round for Sign now. For both teams. Either 5-4, to 5-3 uh, to three, or 4-4. Four to four. That is a huge difference if, difference if you ask me. So um, again, looking good for Team Sign. Megorian and Slotty are the players who are alive, so Milmi has made a mistake seemingly. So after I've praised him so much, he's now dead. And on that last place, Sky is the player who is closest to him, but it doesn't look that he will overtake him. But his teammates can make something happen first and third for them at the moment. Make it first and second though. Another equal and Megorium with a god tier ending as well as Slotty. And they will take it. A point 30 and a point 42 here. Great endings from the Reden players. And with that they have the next points in their hands. So 5 to 3. Another 2 point difference for Team Reden. go into the next round. Round number nine is coming into play. Slotty and Megorian leading the round. Megorian with a great amount of speed here. They accumulate. Let's follow Nebo who is in last or second to last right now. Only ahead of uh, Milmi who we could have seen there just a little bit. Coming closer though. Sky and Marco with great endings. We, we see a mistake. We see two mistakes there but it is Sky staying out of Slotty who was full bonking into the wall. So that was again important for them to get themselves that fifth place. But yeah, a lot of risks we have seen there. Four to five. And Sign is not dead yet. They were behind on the first map as well. And they are now again. So victory would be great for Team Sign in this round. They have to, else they have to win three rounds in a row. So winning now around will relieve some pressure for sure. Slotty with a small release, falling a bit behind Mormi and Nebo with a great start, or with a fastest start rather. And then uh, Marco, Megarion, Slotty and Sky are behind. So no one has made a mistake. Maybe just small releases, but no full stopping or no crash into the wall. Going to the last part of the track. This part very important to get smooth and also this alignment here. Megarion with a great amount of speed. Can he overtake Marco? He also Millimi in the mix, but it will be Nevo with a point 34, another 3x winning it here. Point 44, and what a time! Imagine getting last with a point 63. This is how Sky is feeling right now, but his teammates have him in the backpack. They have gotten first and second, and now the score then is 5 to 5. Sign has won the first uh, map, Busty. 7 to 6. So 
5 to 5. Whoever wins this round will get themselves the map point. And it's looking like Sign will do that. Marco and Sky are leading. However, Slotty is coming closer to Sky, who didn't have the best amount of speed in this sector. But Magorin is already so far behind. So this is already yeah, the, the pre-decided point here for Team Sign. And yes, that's the case. A point 29 for Marco. Great time. Then we have Sky and Nevo on third and fourth. Milmi on fifth. And Magorian with a DNF. So guys, never DNF. We have seen that it can be decided. Um, if you DNF in that uh, previous um, uh, round. Where um, uh, Magorian... On this previous map. Where Magorian was DNFing. And this literally cost them the round win. Of course, in this situation, it didn't matter because all the players have finished. But unless no players finished, everything can and, as you can see, will happen in Trackmania. So, map point for Team Sign again. After Eden was so far ahead, we have Team Sign. We now have the better, better take. Yeah. And also looking very strong here. Marco Nevo and Sky in the mix, but Slotty is on first. Magoria needs that third place, but it will not be enough though. Two hundreds behind, second, third, and fifth for Team Sign, and this is the next victory for them. 2-0. So seven to five. So fourteen to eleven is the scoreline for Team Sign. In favor for Team Sign. Okay, yo, Rambox as well with the raid. Hello, hello. Thank you very much, Rambox. That is much appreciated. You just joined in time. We have some uh, nations action here. The Trackmania Olympics Tech semifinal. Sign versus Reden. So that will be great. And um, yeah, good luck to the teams because the scoreline is 14 to 11 in favor for team sign yeah so 2-0 is the scoreline though and let me do some quick maths sign has to win the four rounds in order to make it so warm up and i'm gonna rest my voice a bit so in the meantime you guys can check out rambox Thank you so much for the raid, man. Great to see that. Nice to see that. This is uh, neither it's regular Trackmania nor it's Trackmania Turbo. It is Trackmania Nations. <clears throat> it's Trackmania Nations. So, some more warm ups, and then we're gonna go live. <clears throat> so, 
So good luck to teams, to both teams. Let me rest my voice a bit because there's still a lot of matches coming up today. So hopefully all doing good guys as I certainly have a great day and I had a great, great weekend. And we have one more warm up before we are going live. Yeah. That will be nice. Good luck, good luck. I mean, a pretty wonky performance from Team Sign at the moment. Or like, in at all, but they've really won when it mattered. It seems that Reedan had the pace, but when it was coming out and closing a match, they were severely struggling, and that's what you win. Hey, that's how you win matches and get points. So 14 to 11. So if Reedan loses four rounds, they will be eliminated and play against Luckers for the third place. <clears throat> so good luck now. Now we are starting. And let's go. Let's go, let's go. So who will take it? That's the question, right? Who will take it? Let's go. Oh, okay, never mind. One more. Okay, there we go. Ladies and gentlemen, the scoreline is 14 to 11 in favor for Sain. And now we're gonna see the last map. We see Kuda, Kubo, Kubanu. And it goes all with an um, apostrophe at the top. It's pointing to the right. It's pronounced like an U, yeah? Because it's Spanish, I think. So uh, thanks, chat, for that. We have Ratchet, Sky, and Nevo playing for Team Sain. And then Tom Megorian and Slotty playing for Team Reden. Reden has lost the two sub matches beforehand and they're not they cannot afford to lose this one. They can only lose three rounds. If they lose four rounds they are dead and will have or have to pack their things and play the match against Luckers for the third place. Ratchet is leading a Megorian and Tom. Tom with a great ending and goes into the lead here. A point 22 from Tom. What a great time. Ratchet on second. Megorian on third. Sky and Nevo on fourth and sixth. And then we have Slotty, who's on P5. It didn't really matter if he get, got P5 or six. It only mattered that he finished. Um, so the first point for Team Reden. And we have a stop. We're just gonna wait. Not sure what will happen. <clears throat> okay, there we go. We are alive again. Let's see who will uh, 
do what here. Slotty and Tom are leading the round. Great start from them. Uh, but it's actually Sky Nevo staying alive. But Ratchet has made a mistake, so he is dead. And it is uh, Tom who has to hold that lead. Also, Sky and Megorian making that same mistake, though. So actually, now Nevo can come. Or oh, like can capitalize from that if he gets a good ending line but Ratchet is too far behind so this will not be enough it will be Tom claiming victory even though Nebo was coming dangerously closer Slotty on a third and then we have Megorian on fourth so again the next point for Team Reden so 2-0 and they're coming closer they're coming dangerously closer 14-13 is the total scoreline now but of course Team Sign has the advantage of winning two maps and also having more points but now the match can start from zero i mean if it's like four zero or something like that then it really matters who just wins the next rounds yeah or if it's three zero who wins the next four rounds let's say like that but it is slotty leading again but look at the speed from neva also sky doing it very well into first and second they go make it second and third now because Lotti had more speed also a great great trajectory here from Nevo into that battle he goes again Sky with a great line and this looks to be the first point for team sign on this map they will all stay alive Sky in the lead Slotty 100th behind Ratchet with a point 30 and then Nevo with a point 36 what a great great round indeed first point for team sign one to two important that they really brought themselves on the scoreboard great rounds so one to two and they take the second round in a row or will it be team reed and just performing well on this one Let's take a look. Tom, Slotty, Megarian. Slotty with a little bit yeah, of a of a wonky line there, let's say like that. And with that, he is um, not going through. Neva with a great amount of speed. The field is just going crazy again. Every position has changed. This will be all decided in the ending. Who will get that? I'm going to follow Sky here, but you cannot really call it here. It is Neva in the lead. Sky and Ratchet in last. A point 37. And Ratchet and Sky are in last position. What was that round? That was absolutely bonkers, guys. That was a great round from all the players, but it was Team Reden getting second, third, and fourth. And with that, they have won this round. Okay, um, I'm sorry, I missed that question. What is Trackmania Nations? I've never heard of this. I have uh, come to watch streams to see difference of Turbo and OG Trackmania. Well, there are more Trackmania installments than just Trackmania 2020 and uh, Trackmania Turbo. This is the game that was coming out in 2008. That is just the difference. Like, let's say Call of Duty. Yeah, of course the games don't really differentiate that much and Call of Duty is way more complex, but I think you get the point. Yeah, it's just a different game. Turbo is a different game than um, Trackmania Nations. Then we have ESWC and all of those things. And Ratchet with a point 21. That was a great time even. But I think this should really like answer your question so yeah it is um, actually team uh, sign uh, taking home the second point so they need only two more victories and we see another mistake from a Reden player Tom is dead. A Megorian and Slotty left alive. And then we see Ratchet, Nebo and Sky with great starts. All only one car length behind. And also Sky here. Or Sky not with the best line by the looks of it. So it is him falling a bit behind. But still it is looking good because Megorian didn't get the best line. Is Sky a fifth place is enough for him. Nebo and Ratchet have to stay ahead but it is actually one of the members from Team Reden making a mistake. It was slotty indeed, and with that they have the next point in the belt, in the pocket. 
three to two, a uh, three to three. So one more round and they have won three rounds in a row. Or two rounds, three rounds, something like that. So Reden has to win four rounds to make something happen. If they lose a single round in the next couple of four rounds, or in the next four rounds, they are dead and eliminated. Tom is leading. Magorian and Stotty, however, are in the mix, but nowhere close to him. Also, Tom with the best line. We have a great round in our hands here. Ratchet going so close to the wall. Magorian still leading. Sky, Nebo, and Ratchet are in the mix, but Magorian with a lot of speed here. Tom has to get himself that third place, but right now there are so many blue players ahead of him. And will, will it be Sky taking it? The first place? No, it is not, but it's still enough. Second, third, and fifth for Team Sign, and that's GG here with that round four to three. So a great performance from Team Sign in this um, very last, um, very last rounds, let's say like that.